it's the Murray in a hurry and I'm here at Cairns Junior Rugby League grounds for the Cairns All Black Carnival. This carnival's been running since 1972 and this year we've got 31 teams competing from as far north as PNG would you believe and as far south as Sherberg we go out west to Mount Isa and we've all got the coastal areas around with all the communities participating in this carnival. Follow me with the barefoot cameras, we'll have a look at the highlights of this week's carnival and talk to some of the people that made it happen. Well, the Murray in a hurry has uh, a very distinguished person. It's the Premier of Queensland, Anna Bly. And Anna, this is your first carnival that you've been to? I've certainly heard about them over the years. It's the first chance I've been to see one, and uh, isn't it terrific? It's got huge support. You know, they're leading great, healthy lives. Uh, rugby League's giving them uh, a real sense of uh, purpose in their communities. Queensland Health is the major sponsor for the carnival, and we're very pleased to back it because it's uh, drug and alcohol free, it's family time. Uh, and it's great physical uh, effort and sport, it makes a big difference. As with all All Black Carnivals, it takes a tremendous amount of organisation and I've got one person here that is one of the coordinators and it is a big job and it's Cole Enoch. And Cole, to put one of these together mate, where's it all begin? Well, I suppose we, we begin administratively with our uh, with Sarah, and Sarah's been administrating these for the last 12 years. Um, we're pretty well self-sufficient at the moment, but um, grant funding would, would help, and you know, we've had Anna Bly here today, and hopefully we can organise a meeting with her sometime down the track and um, talk to her about these issues. How do you quantify that benefit that flows over from that, that they take back to the community? Um, you know, it gives them their self, lifts their self-esteem with them. And it's all those uh, flow-over effects that, that having a team, whether it be football, whether it be this or that, but it's a bonding of those uh, mobs coming together, you know. We see these, these games here in these carnivals that we have in Cairns as modern-day corroborates, where we're bringing everybody together, but not through dance, but through showca showcasing it through, through sports. So this year's my 10 years. So I, I wanted to make it special this year. Um, Usually we come and we play and then we all go home, but we don't sit down and have, you know, my my or kaikai with one another. And we like to sit down and, and yarn, you know, so that Sherba people get to know, um, say, Tawanyama people. And, you know, we meet friends, we socialise and it's building us, uh, you know, ourselves and our well-being, being, so we get to meet a lot of people. So, yeah, no, it, it's good. We structured it different, just to allow, allow for the gala dinner party, but that's because we want to we wanna acknowledge 35 years of... Um, Indigenous rugby league that's been conducted in Cairns as well. Not only just the hard work of you know the 10 years that I've done, but the other 25 years that past organisations and coordinators have put into it. So we want to recognise and acknowledge that. We come up here, wanted to win it because we. We, we, we come to play for uh, two boy, two local fellas who passed away, and in honour of them, we had to win it, so we had to take it out. Yeah. And mate, your performances, I watched, uh, I watched you through the carnival. You were superb, mate, and uh, one of my favourite fullbacks. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I do what I can do, eh, man. Yeah, and for Sherbeck, I'll give my heart, eh, man. November's coming. I hope someone gives me a shot, eh? Just give me a pre-season, show what I can do. And hopefully someone will give me a go, man. Well, mate, the Barefoot crew are there supporting you. But, mate, fantastic for the Sherberg fellas. And, uh, mate, a great trip back home. Yeah, bros. Cairns All Blacks Carnival over for another year. And the Sherberg Stingers, the mighty winners over the Kupiyam Badu Island side. Too strong, too big, the Sherberg Hornets. And they take the trophy home on a 20-hour bus trip all the way back to the Sherberg community. Special thanks to Sarah Addo and her crew because she's staged a magnificent Cairns All Blacks Carnival. She's done it for 10 years now. Let's hope she's around for another 10 years. Well done, Sarah, and all your crew. This is the Murray in a Hurry signing out. I've got to get back to Brisbane. What a time I've had in Cairns.